Hello everyone, Declan here. As promised, I'm going to show you how to have your own video wallpaper or as it was known back in Windows Vista, your dream scene. Uh, this is a very, maybe not very simple, but fairly quick process. So the first thing you'll want to do is open your browser and we're going to get some files. And you can Google Windows 7 Center dream scene. Google that and it's going to be the very first link from Windows 7 Center and um, you click that and you go in and the first thing it tells you is that this will not work if you do not have Windows Arrow enabled and uh, to check if you have Windows Arrow just look at your taskbar and if it is transparent then you have Windows Arrow if you press Windows and Tab key simultaneously and you get this effect then you have Windows Arrow. If you do not get these things just right click somewhere on your desktop personalize and pick one of the Arrow themes the most basic here. Now back to the website mm, back to step two uh, on to step two if you are on Windows 32 bit it's very simple just use this patch and reboot alright um, if you are like me on Windows 60 64 you are going to have to download this other patch not this patch but this patch and follow the very important instructions in readme.txt alright so we're going to get this patch it's a very small download and we, you are going to need some kind of zip or RAR program to take it out of its box. And now you are going to get three files dreamscene.dll, dreamscene.dll.mui, and dscene.reg. So the first thing you'll want to do is read the README. Everything I'm going to do now is explained there but you can just for the purposes of this video I'm just going to show you how to do it um, so first let's go to the root of C Windows and then System32 and uh, here in System32 you will want to place the dreamscene.dll file be careful please not to place the file inside one of the folders by mistake you'll want it inside the system 32 on the on the blank space basically now I'm not going to do it because uh, I, I already have it there and it will ask if I want to replace it and uh, no need basically um, now the dream scene dot DLL dot MUI you are going to want to put that in your en hyphen us folder so you can just open it and boom drag it there I'm not going to do it because it's already there now after you have moved these two files you will just have to run this file execute it enter double click doesn't matter and it will ask for your permission to change your registry and you will allow it and boom there you go it is installed now you have to reboot just boom restart reboot don't worry the video will still be here and the instructions alright I'm assuming you rebooted now you have dreams in installed congratulations what you need now is a nice video so I'm going to supply you with uh, a video that I created the link is in the description because uh, some of you expressed some interest and uh, that's fine and uh, I'm not selfish so sorry I have to kinda track it down but it's here somewhere animated wallpaper girl at blue computer 0 0.4 yeah I didn't give much thought to the title eh. Uh, one thing you'll want to take care of if you are just ready to put your own video there is that it ha needs to be in dot uh, Windows Media Video WMV 
codec or extension. So take care with that. I'll explain how to do that in the next video. But anyway, you find your video, right click it, and set as desktop background. And boom, there we go. You got a nice video wallpaper, if you will notice. Even the, the transparency in the window works perfectly. And uh, that wasn't very hard, was it? All right. So I'll see you in the next video with more instructions on how to make your own videos and how to encode them so they will work with the uh, dream scene. Uh, we'll look at that. She just blinked. Yeah. All right. See you guys. And uh, this, was this was fun. All right. Bye.